Ugh, water, wet, nasty. At least it stopped a little bit. I'm off to Lidl. But first, I need to take the battery off charge. So, welcome to the sauna. I've just been uh, shopping and uh, somebody's fiddling around with the rotor field in the car park, so sorry if you hear some background noise. Um, I tried to do this last week, uh, and fortunately my mic uh, decided it didn't want to work, so here we go again. So, welcome to, or yes, welcome to uh, Dashcam Video 5. Uh, I've not really mentioned the numbers or anything, but it's the first time I've actually said something before the actual dash cam bits. Um, so basically, just to fill you in, um, this van um, is a Sompermi van, so you don't need a license to drive it in France or in Europe. Uh, you just need insurance. If you were born before 1988, which is my case, unfortunately, um, yeah, it was, it's old and uh, get to drive for, uh, for nothing without having to take a test or lessons or anything so I've just sat behind the wheel since 2018 and driven this van now some of you in the UK might think this is quite dangerous but it's quite the normal here because there's lots of rural places places that are very empty where there's no public transport and so this is the next best thing uh, I live in a place which is near Paris but until quite recently about four years ago we had no bus service or very little of a bus service so to get to the station about three miles away, um, you either have to drive, ride your bike or walk. So yeah, um, I sort of bought it so I could get about and do shopping and things and go to the park. Um, but the idea is eventually uh, I'll be able to drive to the next village. I'm still not there yet. Um, I suffer very badly with, with panic attacks. And uh, I think it's, it's for me it's pretty amazing I've got this far really. but. Some of you might not think so, um, but uh, yeah, I need to, to get further and further afield with this van. And basically, this is why I'm doing the dash cam videos because it records me driving. It records the things I come across. Um, sometimes you get people that are going too fast. Sometimes people cut me up. Sometimes people cut corners. Sometimes people just do really stupid things. Even in this village, um, you know, it's a small village, 1,700, 800 people. Um, but you still get the occasional person that just thinks nobody's there, um, I can do what I want. Um, so basically that's why I put the dash cam up. Plus the fact this is a on Permi van, so the insurance premiums are not exactly cheap. And um, if I have a crash, I like to be able to have some sort of proof that, uh, you know, uh, it was their fault or mine. So basically that's, that's why I'm doing these dash cam videos. And I'll try to do an intro roughly about what the video is going to be about. I won't bother now because it's a bit long and uh, I'll just leave it there and I'll leave you to watch the, the videos.
Well, I hope you enjoyed watching those uh, dash cam videos. Please leave any comments uh, down below uh, if the music is irritating, because it has been in a few of the other ones, I think. My wife even said the music was irritating in a few of them. Um, if you can think of um, things that can be improved. Uh, basically, I'm using a cheapo. Well, it wasn't that cheap, actually, when I bought it. So that's my, my dash cam. It's an Abask, if you've ever heard of them. And uh, the quality isn't the most brilliant, but it could be it, it could be worse, couldn't it? So yeah, that's what I use for, for my dash cam videos. So any comments, anything you can think of, just let me know, and I'll see if I can improve things next time. Uh, and so I'm trying to sort of like weed out all the more boring bits and pieces to try to make it so these videos, these dash cam videos, don't come out as often because. It was going to the stage where I just video anything and put it in the video, and that gets a bit boring after a while. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to give me a subscribe if you feel you must. Um, give me a follow on the socials. You'll find my Linktree uh, page down below. And uh, I look forward to seeing you again. Take care of yourselves. Bye.